All right, YouTubers, thanks for watching our brand new channels. We're going to be starting a second series here of uh, Age of Wonders 3. So if you're keeping up with the other one, this one's going to be a separate thing. But please watch both. We would gladly, well, I guess not gladly, but we would appreciate it a lot. A lot. Yeah, a we'd lot. reluctantly appreciate a it. A lot. <laughs> I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Uh, on the other one, I'm playing as the elves, and he's playing as somebody. And by yeah. he, I mean, uh, what are we going to go with you again? Butterlands. Okay, so, it's Butterlands and me, Strategy Nation. For this one, I'm going with the orcs. I think I'm going to go with, uh, Sulfur Nightblade right here. It's going to be like a rogue class. I'm going to be like stealthy and stuff like that. Which one are you, Butterlands? Uh, I'm a... Um, a elf warlord. Warlord. Yeah. Your rise to power begins in three seconds. My rice? Like food? <laughs> yeah, rice. Your <laughs> rice to power. <laughs> I just, like, automatically bought that hero. It's like, I don't even care what stats he has, I, I want him. Oh, get this, uh, the, the main mission, the victory requirement. Defeat all enemy empires, no shit. Yeah, just wreck them all. <laughs> no shit. Oh my god, so I got like brand new research, research skills I got. I gotta learn now. Okay. Summic Krimic Crows. I do like all the summoning skills. Okay, I always go for seafaring first. That's the theme of I'm the not even by water, so. All right, so. Defeat all rival empires. Do, do you usually take the reward for like when they when you get a reward from? Uh... I I don't know what that means. <laughs> Uh, like when you win a fight and there's like a reward for winning, and it tells you, it asks oh, you yeah. like, do you want to take the reward or sell it? I, I've only had that happen once and I sold it because it was a lot of money. I've taken it twice and it's nice because it gives you that free unit. So FYI. Yeah, that's good. Uh, I found a refugee camp. I gained 993 orc, orcs. Whereabouts on the map are you? Uh, bottom right corner. Like, literally, oh shit, almost... we keep spawning like as far away from each other I know, as possible. No, it's like they do it on purpose. Oh, it's not changing. I'm not, I'm not finding any gold. Pretty upset. More independent parties. For some reason, it looks like I'm completely I'm like on an island. God, that would that would suck. It might be true. That would <laughs> like suck the map. So bad. There's there's a little hope. There's a little hope that I haven't discovered yet, but not much. I mean, that would be pretty bad. It would be pretty awful, yeah. Oh. There's a cartographer tent. See, I, I don't fully understand yet why uh, all sorts of different independent parties have like different colors and stuff. But I've noticed that the red ones are the ones that usually try to attack my actual cities. I don't know if it's just been coincidence. Okay, luckily there's a bridge that leads to a nearby... Um... Neutral town. Huh. Like a an actual uh, player, AI player, or like a city state. I think it's a city state. We don't we don't even know if that's what they're called. We just keep calling them city states. It's just a place. <laughs> <laughs> a place that I can take over. 
pretty much. I love the variety of units. Like, there's a lot of units. Yeah. The you know zoom I mean? out thing looks pretty Lord of the Rings ish. I know. I do like Lord of the Rings though. I mean, I'm pretty happy with this game so far. I don't know about you. Yeah. Once you get past the confusion, it's pretty fun. Yeah. Alright, so I got a shield. Hell yeah. And a uh, orc impaler. Sorry about that, guys. My laptop died. Oh. Oh, and in case we hadn't mentioned it, this is Sebastian. I'm not in the game, just. He's a narrator. Yeah. Like the pizza pie. <laughs> a narrator. I love how I got a title now. <laughs> I feel so loved. You are, man. Lewis. You are. <laughs> I dubbed thee that guy. <laughs> so I have a poison mastery spell that it gives my infantry and cavalry and regular units plus two strength. I wonder if it's like a one turn thing or if it's like a permanent thing. So, what did I miss? Uh, not much. I just found two towns by going to cartographer tents. Well, I think it's like a permanent thing, so just FYI. What? Uh, if you do like a bonus spell on your units, I mean, I'll, I'll let you know next turn, but it seems like it's a permanent thing. Like to give bonus stats to your uh, army. Oh. So like an upgrade in uh, uh, in stats like strength and whatever oh yeah I haven't really explored a lot. Neither have I. There are four production resources around me, but not really like any gold or food and stuff. I don't understand how the skills act, uh, skills work. I know um, spells, spells. Ooh, I got a scarf. Ooh, I got an epic item. That's too spooky, fight me. What do you, what, what do you not understand about skills? Spells, spells. I don't know what they do. Oh, spells? <laughs> Yeah, uh, it, it tells you what it does. Like if, like the blue tab is like actual spells you can cast, like in in the game. So, I mean, it basically tells you what it does. So I don't, I don't know. But if it's a summon Wait. one, then it's gonna give you like a unit once the spell is complete, and you like summon it to wherever you want, I guess. But oh. it's gotta be like next to like one of your heroes or like within your radius. And the other ones are just like different types of spells. And then the research is just well research.
I don't know. I've I've just been trying to do like all my level one research, and then I'll do like my level two, and so on. It's been working so far. Dude, how do you change like the order of of construction? Um, I, uh, I don't know. Cancel. Oh, yeah. I guess I'll just do that. I think I'm gonna make my own YouTube channel. That's a good idea. What are you gonna stream or upload or whatever? My point of view of the uh, Victoria Two games that we do. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I might do uh, Warband and then uh, Game Dev Tech here, and I'm not sure. Uh, Warband? Like Mountain Blade? Yeah. You play that? Yeah. I tried to get into it, and God, the multiplayer is just so awful. Uh, I can't do multiplayer because it's not connected to Steam. Oh, there's still plenty of uh, there's still plenty of servers and stuff for it. Oh, yeah. Then, like, then. if you go to multiplayer and within the game, there's a lot. I can't, I can't play Mountain Blade right now because my mouse is missing again. That game it, it's just so like weirdly hard in multiplayer. Like people that oh. lag just like appear and disappear and they're like stab you from the back. It's it's so weird. You should get like a carrying case strapped to your leg for your mouse, and you just keep it on no, it all time, because, and you'll never lose it. Because my mom borrowed the laptop, and now the mouse is missing again. Oh, so it you're, wasn't even mouse. you're mouseless again. Yeah. I'm sorry. It's sad. <laughs> I feel for you. Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah. Alright. <clears throat> if I don't want a hero, how do I get them to fuck off? I think they leave after a couple turns. Yeah, that's good. I don't, I don't feel like having another hero right now. What? I don't have the money, and I don't have the patience to build another army for a while. That is true. Actually, or I might have to in a few minutes anyway. I mean, I just do it because, I mean, you don't really get to choose when you want one, so... I just keep him there, even if I don't need him. Infiltration squad. I hate squad. when a website like tells you what your password needs to be. What do you mean? What do you mean? Like when it's like you have to have one upper, one uppercase, two lowercase, at least one symbol and a number. I hate when websites do that. Oh, mine has to be a grammatically correct sentence. I just revealed like an unknown area. And it looks pretty freaking scary. It's like my cities that I make look like crap, and then I see like the AI cities, and it looks like a freaking Lord of the Rings fortress. Yeah, the struggle of being a human. <laughs> well, I'm orcs. Uh, that's probably even worse. Yeah, did like the did they have specialties for all the races, right? So like, do the orcs move slower through technology and stuff? Are they more uh, like primitive? It's like the difference between races is like so huge that I, I wouldn't even be able to, to tell you because I don't know the other ones. Like it's different research and different abilities and different bonuses and different units. Mm -hmm. I think the only thing that remains the same is the uh, the building structure, from what I noticed. Uh, within your cities. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't I haven't noticed any like specific race uh, buildings so far. But do the buildings do different things for the different races, or they're the same all around? I mean, the bonuses might affect them differently, but I think the buildings themselves do the same thing. Oh, 
Pimp City has grown. <laughs> Pimp City. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hear he, hear he. I, I don't even know what to say. I'm just trying to imagine like old like medieval times and like they named something Pimp City. <laughs> Yeah, I don't I don't know why anybody would. <laughs> the siege of Pimp Pimp City 1683. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Vienna was, Pimp City. Why? Oh, with the Ottomans. Huh? Yeah. It was Pimp City. It's just the Illuminati telling you it was called Vienna, but it's really Pimp City. <laughs> Oh, I, I noticed a unique unique building now that I didn't have before. It's called a uh, planar gate. And I know it's unique because it's got like the features of my race, I guess. Like the drawings. I just met a guy that wants to kill me. Uh, you should uh, give him a hug. <laughs> He's like, you'll die by my hand. No way. Yeah, that's the first thing he said to me. <laughs> but, yes, way. but you said that though, right? <laughs> I'm gonna take over the city state. I wanna like summon another Green Beak Green Beak Crow. That's what it's called. But I can't afford it. Struggle is real. Yeah, so, so that place I discovered is called uh, Mold Beloth. Like, I mean, that doesn't even sound good. <laughs> it doesn't even sound. <laughs> yeah, like, why would you even want to go there? Oh, I I love it when it asks me if I want to let them run when I attack. I love it so much. It makes you feel good about yourself. Well, I don't have to risk losing a unit. Or waiting for them to heal. Insufficient funds. What? Get out of here. <laughs> when you take over a city without losing a single troop. You just did that? Yeah. Oh, I hate you. Was it like a independent? Yeah. I hate you. I know. Let's use nice words, people. I had to make my own city. You think griffins are easy to kill? <laughs> yes. I don't know, there's three of them and they look pretty mean. So I'm debating many things right now many life choices I've made from the last half an hour or so <laughs> wait has one video already ended for this no this is the first one for this one right yeah we're still so on uh, part it's one been it's been 20 minutes it's been 20 minutes oh, we still good okay. So you've made life choices in the past 20 minutes. I mean... I've made some choices. That I probably choice. would not repeat. Damn, what the... I'm like at a, at a point where like... I'm so broke I can't really do anything. So I'm just like, really? Yeah, so I'm just like waiting for stuff to happen. I'm like waiting for my units to heal in between battles. Oh my 
god, I just lost another one. Yeah, I'm gonna attack this independent city. Like, I don't even care. I feel like I had another stack, but I don't. So weird, right? Yeah. Don't do drugs. <laughs> oh, the outposts of Art Grub. They're asking me if I want to do a peace treaty in exchange for 59 gold. Hell no. Prepare to be destroyed. <laughs> like, how do you ask for a peace treaty and then ask for money at the same time? There we go. Okay, I have my logo for my um for my YouTube channel. Are you really making one? <laughs> yeah. And it's really gonna be about you watching Victoria videos or what? No, it's my when we I play Victoria Two with Butterlands. I don't have my point of view posted. Oh, but it's gonna be the same game, just a different point of view. Basically. And probably I'm gonna go do my own stuff as well. That's cool. Yeah. Like Game Dev Tycoon. That seems to be getting pretty popular on YouTube right now. The what? Game Dev Tycoon. What is that? It's just a simplistic tycoon, but it's some funny stuff can happen, so it's been getting pretty popular. Gotcha. I'm gonna wreck this place right now. It's an independent party They're trying to ask me for money. They're just gonna get wrecked. I don't know. What should I name my third one? Oh, it's like a camp thing, I guess. No, I can rename it. <clears throat> oh, so you have like some city options after I took it over. I can release it again as a vassal. Or just absorb all the people into my population, plunder it, or raise it. I think absorbing it would make it a city, like a separate city. Uh, yeah, I think it would delete the city and just move the people to my place. That would be weird. I, that's what I, I don't, I don't, I don't feel like finding out. I, like I think I'm just gonna keep using it. Trail of Tears. But uh, I can't use it until like the people become happy or something. Oh, until I choose what I want. Uh. I hate using a trackpad with everything. Oh my god. Okay, so I'm serving the people into my empire. I hope that doesn't delete the, the city and just move the people over. I'd be pretty upset. Night vision. How are you doing over there? Pretty good. I'm gonna make another city. Another one? Yeah. Another one. That's cool. But I have to wait until I get my settler and then I build an army. A third army to use to transport the settler. What's that it name? seems like every time I try to get started on YouTube, they have like new requirements you have to go through before you can start posting videos, and it's really annoying. <laughs> Why do you keep trying to? But not actually do it different phases of my life, like before I used to be like a Yu-Gi-Oh nerd, so I posted Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Oh. 
What should I name my third city? I haven't played Yu Gi Oh for like three years. I still want to get back into it, but I'm not sure when or how to get back into it. Oh, they have live streaming on YouTube now? Mm-hmm. That's pretty garbage, huh? Yeah, I don't think- It's not that bad. Really? I don't th I, mean, I never thought it was a thing yet. It's been out- I, I used it like the day it came out for a little while. But are there like actual people following it? I don't know. I feel, I feel like Twitch pretty much won that market already. Yeah, Twitch has a bigger viewer base. Yeah, plus, I mean, isn't Twitch already owned by YouTube or something now? Or is it Amazon? Uh... Might be Amazon. I don't remember. I'll Google it right now, guys. I think they were I'm... gonna sell it Amazon, but they went with someone else at last second or something. Oh, okay. Why would they even sell it? Because... Because a lot of money. <laughs> Amazon has more resources, too. Yeah. Orc priest. That sounds interesting. Uh, Google owns Twitch. Oh. <laughs> of course. Why would we think <laughs> otherwise? <laughs> Why would? <laughs> oh my God. Google. Google. No. Or it's like some kind of joint owning between Google and Amazon. I'm confused. Oh, nice. I can make Orc Greatsword. It looked pretty be it's... beastly. Yeah, I think they just split it in half or something. I don't even understand. <laughs> They're silly. Last two units fighting uh, independent. That's pretty pretty rare so far. What do independents just not have large armies? Uh, I mean they. From what I've noticed, normally they're like three or four, but that one was only a three. Three stack. Might have been a higher level of of units that I'm used to, I guess. The video is over. Okay. Alright guys, thanks for watching part one. If you like, please subscribe and check out Butterlance channel as well. Thank you. See ya.